Hello, Lucas here, back with another video. Now, today, I'm going to be reviewing the LEGO Star Wars Rogue One Microfighter for the Y-Wing. I have the big version, but it's in storage, so I can't review it, so I decided to build the smaller one. So now, let's take a look at the minifigure. So, the minifigure of this set is a Blue Squadron Rebel Pilot which if you read the Rogue One visual guide you would know that this is Barry and Rainer for the helmet because the helmet design looks pretty much like it except there's a few differences but I really like that helmet it's super detailed um, with like the it has like a Y-Wing logo on the side but Barry and Rainer is actually an X-Wing pilot so it's a bit weird to go with the Y-Wing? I don't know, but you can see a couple differences with the torso. The torso is a bit, it's pretty similar, except obviously it's in blue, but difference is, the main difference is the legs, which the legs is a bit different. So I'll compare this to Dak Rautar. Um, you can see the difference with, I think this has less more details, I don't know, but you can see just the slight differences. It doesn't have like the bullet thing or whatever, I don't know. But there's a slight difference. Um, the face is the same. Um, now comparing it to the back, uh, nothing too unique there. Um, it's pretty similar as well. But uh, if you take a look at the alternate face, he has like a scared look, or yeah, a scared or a sad look um, that like comes with like every Lego pilot. So back to the build of the set. It's pretty cool. It looks a lot like the Y wing from the big Rogue One set, looks really nice. Um, I think they captured the engine design perfectly by using these, I call them telescope pieces to represent that long wiry thing they have on the Y-Wing. So that's really nice. The, the cannon as well looks pretty accurate to it. And of course, there is a place for you to sit your pilot minifigure so you can just get him and sit him down there. Um, the seat is a bit low, so you're gonna have to move the hands a bit higher. So let me do that now. Um, there you go. You can see it right there. And if you try sitting it down, you can put the hands down if you like, but then your the hands will move. So yeah, you can push it down if you like. You can still lean it back. Um, but the main play feature with it is actually the push missiles, which. You just push this, and it just some of it goes flying. This one's a pretty bad shot, um, but yeah, the kind of push missiles are kind of making a return. So yeah, that's them. But uh, yeah, that's really it for the builds. Um, you can just also put back the push missiles right in here when you're done using it. Um, I really like the the way the wings are built. I just can't stop saying that it looks nice. Um, but I believe. This was supposed to be in a gray, um, but you can see how it attaches right here. It just goes on the Technic pin, and you can just put it back on. So yeah, that is really it for the build. So if you want to see more LEGO Star Wars videos, because I haven't done many LEGO Star Wars videos too often, leave me a comment down below. Yesterday, I did a Star Wars video, so you can check that out. So yeah, that's it for today guys. Bye!